Hey there guys, today I have an interesting build on Bubba, I don't think I've ever seen this build before, but I thought I might as well try it. So I have the speed limiter add-on so my chainsaw doesn't insta down, but I also have the add-on to make it so that they um, can't heal for 90 seconds. I wasn't paying attention to my charges. Perfect. I didn't mean to do that. I should just get this out of the way. I played that rather dumb. Yeah, I can't commit to that chase for much longer. I don't know, I don't play Bubba that much. Not that good of a bubba. I can't make plays like that. Jeez, I look away from my freaking. That balanced, and that's balanced. Someone has a firecracker, but I don't think they're around. Those scratch marks were misleading. Man, I regret having speed limiter on. I just tapped my freaking thing too. I just tapped my thing for another charge. By the way, you can't, if you can't tell, these guys are all Survive With Friends, I think. Because every single one of them is clawed at. I genuinely couldn't see where she went. Although it has been a minute of me not playing. I really have to make a big comeback somewhere, somewhere right about now if I want to win this game.
I don't know how good this combo is because I can't incentivize people to heal and waste their time when I hit them with a chainsaw. So really, almost as less than just a speed limiter. trying to look left, but I just couldn't for some reason. I genuinely didn't see what they did there. I'm playing very sop sloppily this game. I guess I am playing a killer with pretty much no power right now, because speed limiter They're definitely gonna be on this gen. There's three people doing nothing. Or coming to at least. There's, there's three people doing nothing right now. And that worries me. Maybe one of them or two of them healing. But besides that, I don't see what else they could be doing. That was just an unfortunate series of events right there. I would almost be a stronger killer just by him without even using my chainsaw. Because at least I don't have that big of a punishment for bumping into stuff. saw that other person but I need to do this you can't body block all four hooks that was a lazy firework attempt or attempt at a firework save I mean Found two people, that's good. Yeah, I never mention my perks. I mostly just have barbecue on for points more than anything else. I have insidious for special occasions, probably. Monitor to sneak up on people more. I don't want to pick them up because then I'll get DS'd. I saw crows fly, that means there's someone over here. I don't want to commit to that chase. They don't have pallet, but shack pallet, but still. They could probably run me for a good while there. I don't know what this girl is doing.
I don't remember if this is the one I hooked or not. If it is, this is gonna be bad for me. Nope. Wasn't. I'm gonna kick this in and interrupt that. I failed two skill checks. So that's a lot of progress lost. Ashamed. I need somebody with my chainsaw. They can make a recovery from this. But if they can't heal, it'll be harder for them to come back from this. I'm gonna hook this girl real quick. I don't wanna have to go back. And to split pressure. This isn't the person I already hooked. Never mind, it was. Well, at least there's one person I less to worry about. It's hard to keep track of how many hooks I've hooked people on when they're all clawed at. And now both of them are, that's really good. One's going up, one's going to the left. Can pick like I'm going for her, and then I can cut this girl off probably. Close. I'm gonna make an effort to hit her with my chainsaw so she can't heal. this gen they couldn't get the save but neither of those can hook and then I'll go after the person who just unhooked maybe get it down on the person that just got off hook I don't want to be mean but if I can I will this person is more vulnerable right now but I don't think I can commit to chase with them they have a lot of distance I've been on one game this almost this entire game. Or one gen, I mean. I'm hardcore gen patrolling right now. These gens are not about to get done anytime soon. Almost a hundred percent. I don't think so. The one girl that could heal did and then unhooked, I think. Yep, that's exactly what happened. She didn't go for the pallet. I think that was a mistake. I'm just going to hit her here. If I had enduring, that was going to be a grab. I'm going to break that. And then go for these guys. None of them had adrenaline. So I can still down them pretty easily. I'm booking it towards this exit. I think. Yeah. They're over here. I found them. Oh, okay. I was about to say, is there someone hiding behind this rock? But no. It's just a bug. But they sound like they're on the hook.
Oh, jeez. This is not good for me. I honestly can't tell where she was, because... I honestly can't tell what's going on, because of that freaking Claudette on the hook making noise. I think I'll commit to this chase. That was sad. I didn't want to tantrum there. She's just gonna drop that anyway. There's no more pallet over there. I can get this. Wow, I pretty much insta down with the tank with the speed limiter. Can you believe that? They actually let that happen. I don't think I can interrupt that. No, all I can do is force altruism. I know there's a person over here, I just gotta go find him. I don't wanna camp this person. Cause then we'll just leave. I just saw this person. There they are. They're trying to open the gate. I can down two of them here. I got one down. I hear that clawed at and that's messing with me. I could just open that gate and leave. I'm not gonna let that happen. I'm gonna try and they open the other gate. I think they failed the 99 or something. I hope this girl isn't on death hook so I can try and force altruism. I don't know if I can make this, I wasn't counting. I can't. That's sad. Yeah, I get it. The other person's at the gate. Why was there no, it was one hook within like 60 meters or something like that. Like that entire like little cornered off area, there's one hook. <laughs> 